My dad and I are working on a project. Should be good. What we're going for is an emulation-based arcade machine. So, MAME, Super Nintendo, Genesis, emulators for pretty much everything 2000 and back, plus some extra features that we're still working out. For the cabinet itself, I found a Mortal Kombat 2 shell on Craigslist that was in really good shape for a really good price. Even though it still needs a good deal of work, this was a much better and cheaper option than building the cabinet ourselves. This was perfect for the project, and I'm really glad that we'll be able to use an original cabinet. It's going to take a lot of work to restore and then remodel this cabinet, but I'm sure it's going to be fun. In researching projects like this, I find a lot of cases where people are kind of cheap with these. I don't see the point. I mean, if you're going to go to all the effort, why are you just going to go buy a $200 pre-built PC that you'll just cram the tower in the back, make a shelf that you sit a monitor on, not try and hide the monitor? At that point, you're just making a glorified computer desk that happens to look like an arcade cabinet. And oh my god, the control panels. I can't wait until I do a video on the control panels. I have so many of them to show you. They're hilarious. Anyways. For our configuration, we'll be assembling a caseless PC in the back on a platform that we've already constructed, and we'll be mounting the monitor. It's a flat panel monitor. I know it's not authentic, but it's really not a problem. Uh, onto a piece of wood that we've already mounted that follows the original angle of the original display that was inside of the cabinet. And for our control panel, we're going to do something that's actually kind of sane. I'll go into details more on that and the individual components later when we actually get to that point. But right now, I just wanted to show you guys that this is the project that we're working on. Uh, this is our progress so far. We have it mocked up in something like how it's going to look, but not really. Anyways, thank you for watching. And if you have any recommendations or you want to say anything about the project, you want to recommend me any names for the machine, because right now, all of the names that we're throwing around are pretty much jokes. And... I'm not too hot on calling it the Arcadus Maximus 3000. So, if you have any recommendations, feel free to share. But yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll let you guys know how the project goes.